dream that lies in wait for me. As the night awakens, all my demons, I can't go back.
you. Man, thank you so much for being here tonight. There are a lot more people here than I thought would be here. So thank you so much. Because um, feeling good about yourself is about the quantity of people in your life. Right? Uh, see, at, at shows like this, you can say all the jokes and people just are happy for you and they'll laugh. So thank you so much. Oh uh, man, guys, my parents are here. All the way from Colorado. Also my sister and her boyfriend, my other sister and her husband. And my daughter's here. <laughs> and I just found out my friend, one of my other friends that I grew up with from Colorado is here. And I just saw him in the lobby right before this. So seriously, um, it means so much, it means so much to me. Um, yeah, we're just gonna keep going. This song is called Steady.
Awesome. That's uncomfortable. It's great. Um, cool. Maybe I'll take the time to introduce my band. All of these guys were very instrumental in the making of this record. Uh, so we'll start on the drums, Reese Kling. Let's just like look at that smile. Can you, can you see it from out there? It's amazing. It's a good thing I'm looking this way because I would just be staring at that the whole day. I'm sorry. Cooper Doton on the bass. Not on this next song, but on the song following. Just watch him the whole time. Because it's outrageous. Oh man. Got Hank Donato on the drums. What do you do? He's okay. And then Matt Patrick over there on the guitar. So Matt makes the record. Um, and literally before he mixed it, it sounded like a toddler made it, and he made it sound like it sounds now. So thank you, Matt. And I can't tell you how much you did, and seriously, these other guys as well. Like, it's, it says Ben Noble on the thing, but really it's so much more than that. So, one more round of applause for these guys. Alright, and the next two songs are kind of weird, so...
Alright, this next song is called Beneath Your Wings.
Whatever, this is my first gig, so... <laughs> I love that joke. Um, man, I just, yeah, there are some more people that I want to say thank you to. I don't know if he's, I don't know if they're here. Um, my friend Aaron Ancrum, like, I don't know if he's here, he's really tall. He's, he's, like, four and a half years ago, he told me, like, I was meeting him with, we meeting with him for coffee, and I was really angsty, and just like, what are we gonna do with my life, and stuff like that. And Aaron just said, you could just quit your job and do music. And I'm like, can I? <laughs> Um, and, I don't know, for whatever reason, he made me feel like it was cool to just do that. So thank you, Aaron. That started off a lot. Um, he's, he's also really helped me out along the way. He's, like, giving me opportunities, let me hang out in the studio. Um, that's my, that's my kid. <laughs> Who I love very much. Um, yeah. And then I also want to thank my family. Um, all of the family I grew up with. And then my family now, especially Becca. Becca's been with me through it all. She's thrown me on this crazy journey, and it's been really amazing. Like, I don't know. She's really been a rock, so I'm very thankful. Um, yeah, and so this next song is called Lion Heart. And this song is actually for my son, Ari, who's not here. But he's somewhere. He's sleeping. He's probably yeah. sleeping. <laughs> Yes, we have, we have a babysitter. All right, here we go. <laughs> Oh, 
shape the way that I interact with people. Even with a good starting line, I know that there's a lot of digging that needs to be done. Be careful digging at that. I know that I will pass my past onto my kids, so I need to take a look at myself and try to see what I'm passing on. So then I, I look outward, I look at our city. I remember seeing a sign in the city of Stillwater, Minnesota. It's over, a lot, a lot of you probably have been there. Um, it's over on the St. Croix River. They refer to it as the birthplace of Minnesota, 1848, as if people didn't live here for hundreds and hundreds of years before that, right? <laughs> I look at how theft of land injected trauma into cultures of the people who lived here, and I see how it continued in a cycle of trauma on and on and on and on until this day. So I want to take a second and acknowledge that we're having this concert on land that was stolen. And an astronomical amount of stuff has gone down on this spot over the past few hundred years. So I just want to nudge you to look into how these streets and neighborhoods came to be and think about what they were put in place of. This was not the birthplace of Minnesota. I wrote a little note that's inside the CD cover. It talks about a lot of what I just mentioned. There's a seemingly endless cycle of trauma that finds its way into each of our lives in numerous ways. I hope that this art inspires you to both look inward and outward and see how you can make things right. Whether that's joining a support group, seeing a therapist, being vulnerable and asking a friend to listen to you. I hope that this makes you think about why certain people live where they do and why some people have a lot and some people have a little. And I hope it makes you do something about it. So. So 
the album is called Where the Light Comes In. It's taken from a quote uh, that says, the wound is where the light enters you. Um, and so basically when we treat the wound, like that's how things can be made right. Um, and so I guess like the goal of my music is just healing. Um, healing in myself, healing in people around me, healing in the world. Um, and yeah, the next time I want to play is not from this album, but it's called Heal the Might. And it kind of also sums up a lot of what's going on. And I don't know, I, I have a friend in the hospital right now who's doing chemo stuff, and so I just want to give this, I want to dedicate this song to him, so the song's for you, Matt.
steady stream rocks from the boulders Then the light comes in I'm lost on your shoulder Thawing a colder thin Where the light comes in Where the light comes in Awesome. <laughs> right now, when we have a band full of people just turning knobs, who's who's doing what sometimes? <laughs> so, um, all right, I sh I, I'm going to break from the set list once. I'm going to play wherever my daughter is. I've been singing a lot about my son, so I should sing about her. So I T-shirts for the first time ever. Ben Noble T-shirts. Okay. Um, 
I would love it if everybody just bought t-shirts. That'd be really cool. <laughs> I think that they're pretty cool. Um, I, when I, they're soft. <laughs> when I got mine, I honestly like wore it for three days straight. I was so giddy, so. <laughs> Oh man. So yeah, after the show, go buy a t-shirt for your, your boy Ben. Um, but yeah, on the on that t-shirt it says, All the world is inside you, and that is from this song. And it's just about how there's like a whole world inside each of us, and you can't treat people badly because it's like, there's so much more than every single human being. So, that's what that's all about. <laughs> Alright, last song, here we go.
you know, walk off stage and we're gonna watch that time for a nine quarter cool episode.
you all so much. Come say hi to me. Um, please buy a, buy a t-shirt. Um, but please, please come say hi to me. It's so good to see all of you. So thank you for being here.